EU vessels, many of them from France, have been handed carte blanche to plunder UK waters with the government handing out almost 1,700 fishing licenses since the start of the year, according to a new report. Meanwhile former Brexit Party MEP Ben Habib has urged Prime Minister Boris Johnson to ditch his timid approach and get a grip of the situation, while suggesting French President Emmanuel Macron's frequent complaints were a calculated attempt to bash the British in order to make domestic political capital. Pro-Brexit think tank facts for EU analysed official figures published by the UK government which showed nearly 1,700 EU vessels have been granted licences to enter British waters within 200 nautical miles, of these, 117 are able to sail up to 6 miles from the United Kingdom's shores. Facts 4 EU's analysis indicates 44% of the new licenses issued in the last nine months, a total of 738 were granted to French ships. Just 35 small vessels from the entire EU27 fleet have been refused licenses, and only because they have so far been unable to prove they were fishing within the 6 to 12 nautical miles of territorial waters off the British coast prior to Brexit. If they can do so, they will also be granted licenses. Mr Habib told Express.co.uk of the Trade and Cooperation Agreement TCA, signed by Mr Johnson in December, on paper the deal was self-evidently bad. It did not come close to fulfilling the fishing promises made by the Prime Minister and Lord Frost, now we have empirical evidence the Europeans are fishing our waters to their heart's delight all the way down to our six-mile limit. Turning his attention to Mr Macron, who has been particularly vociferous in his insistence that French ships be granted licenses to fishing in the seas off Jersey, Mr Habib said, the fuss Macron is making about the inadequacy of fishing licenses is a fuss he would have made no matter what the outcome. He delights in bashing the Brits and has everything to gain domestically by doing so. It is a double benefit for him. Delve deep into our waters, catch what they like and still complain they've been hard done by. Queen Margaret II to bring Karen Blixen's image creating worlds to life in Netflix film.